Come on. They were on the other side of this. Are you getting on, Marshal? Well, that bastard is holed up tight as he can be. I've already had two men shot since last we spoke. That's too bad. Luckily, I brought in the cavalry, so to speak. You have, huh? Yes. My associates. And what's more, I think I found a way of ensuring they don't get themselves shot. Like your deputies. Put those on. Teddy Brown is a bad man. One of the worst. But there's folk in Blackwater, powerful folk, who asked my boss to get me to leave him alone. I can imagine. Amos Lansing and Jeremiah Shaw, perhaps? Oh, I don't know. Maybe. My lord, look at you. I read about this. Australian, I believe. Always wanted to see if it works. My friends, let me take you up. Come on. Bring us Teddy Brown. Dead or alive? Ah, Teddy Brown's gonna pay for this! I'm afraid of you fools! God damn you! God damn you! No! God damn you, Teddy Brown! Hello, Mrs. Leclerc. <sighs> Who killed my husband? Who killed my husband? Your husband? That little milksot? <laughs> I guess I imagine he was your brother. No woman would ever marry his kind. <sighs> I did kill him. I did it. And he was begging for his life. <laughs> Pathetic, really. Who put you up to it? <laughs> Who? 
Lady, that's none of your damn business. Then I guess we'll kill the lot of them. That's one down, three to go. Mr. Horley, pay our friends for their service. Thank you. We shall be in touch.